Hey everyone, it's Larry from WSTrades.com doing a update on ticker symbol PIXY or Shift to Pixie Inc. And you know, hate to say I told you so, but I told you so, Pixie fanboys. Got bashed in the comments of the last one that you know I'm just sour grapes because I missed the move and all that. And it's like nah, tech looking at the charts, I didn't miss anything. So I called out 88 cents as soon as they broke that. Um I thought they'd hit around 60 something, yeah, around 67 which they did, and you do see this big rip off of support, uh, but there's just no volume in it. This you know, volume was uh, 737,000 shares, and on the candle before that, you had a big spike over a million shares uh, difference in this selling. So, you know, yeah, you had a big rip off of support, but there just was no volume behind it. So, a uh, few good signs that, you know, they did rip off of support, uh, but low volume. And now they're just consolidating super sideways right now, but you do have the momentum coming into this thing. So, you know, it's for now, you know, you got good support at around 67 cents. Um, unless you can get some volume pumped into this thing, I would assume it's going to come retest that at least. And then, you know, we'll see if that holds. Uh, but it's just, you know, one of those things. And, you know, in the comments every time it's, yeah, we'll look at the short interest, short interest. And it's like, well, yeah, things that are heavily shorted are heavily shorted for a reason. Like if you look at the fundamentals of this thing, I don't remember what website it was, but um, unless they do another offering or get some sort of money from some outside source, they have, I believe, a 92% chance of going bankrupt within, I think it was two years. So, you know, it's not a great company if you're here for, you know, these just short uh, stock plays, then, you know, I guess, but yeah, I'm not holding on. I definitely wouldn't trade this thing to the long side. And, you know, it's dumped so hard that, you know, options aren't even an option at this point. And, you know, shorting something at 80 cents, who cares? You know, what are you going to get 80 cents out of if they go bankrupt? So, yeah, uh, yeah, I, I just wouldn't trade this thing. It's a horrible company. If you look at the just long-term downtrend, it's been in forever. And you had, you know, this stupid spikes from uh, kind of meme stock stuff. But besides that, it's, I don't see this thing going anywhere. Uh, they had earnings on uh, about the middle of January and, you know, had a little rip and then it's just been dumping since then. So not going to have earnings or probably any good news for a while. So yeah, I wouldn't trade this thing. I think it's going to come down and at the very minimum test like 67 cents. So uh, prove me wrong, get some volume pumped in this thing and, you know, make it move. But until then, I think it's probably going to just travel in this channel between around a buck and 67 cents. If you know, one of those levels hold.